everybody. Today we're gonna be uh, doing a cold start with my lawnmower. Um, you've only ever seen it start after it's been warmed up, and so this is gonna be the first time for it being cold. Uh, so the engine is not warm at all. Uh, and I found a good size tobacco weed that um, we can pull out. And also, my newly fitted bull bar. I have had the front tip up before when I got a bit of grip and going a bit sideways while putting, pull something, pulling something out. So uh, you get three litre milk bottles and you can, as you can see, put them on the end which doesn't interrupt with the tyres too much, which you don't need to be turning much when you're driving around. But you can fill those with water to put some more weight in the front so it won't tip up. You can also put the water in the front tyres, which also works. But, I mean, I don't want to be having it on all the time, so I can just put them on and take them off as I please. So we better get on with it. I'll do a cold start. Safety glasses and my earmuffs. It hasn't been liking cold stuff lately, so yeah. Here she is. I got the two water bottles up front. Um, they seem to be rubbing on the tyres, but that's good enough. It doesn't really matter. I got this rope 
bit of excess just sitting loose and then the two that is tied to a tow ball yes you can put a tow ball on my lawnmower um i have broken this rope before on other trees uh with second gear and so that's why i doubled it up but if we go into here quickly um you can see it's actually a pretty thick uh tobacco weed here uh so it might take a bit too much to pull out as you can see i'm not even budging it so yep there she is you can see what i have for my camera set up and so there's that there and you can just sit that like that there we go and now you'll be able to see what it's like when it's not cold and you go to start it. You should start straight up. So, nothing much really happened. There's my mower. It held good. I skidded a whole heap. Um, but, yeah, that's fine. Because I can just rake it over. Mum won't notice much. Uh, you can see that the bark on the thing has been taken off you can't really see but still the bark's been taken off where the rope is trying to pull it but yeah it's uh, pretty big so I might have to get the uh, hoe or something out to rip up some of the big roots so I'll see you later. Attempt two, so I've weakened it. I chopped off some roots. There's the hoe there. And I found this metal plate so I can get... Yeah, yeah, I know. Um, we have some visitors here, but um, it's some um, grooved metal to get more grip. And I've flatten the tire which is probably only about 5 psi in them now instead of um, they're usually supposed to be for how much uh, they're supposed to run 12 psi I usually run about 20 psi in them but here's attempt 2 I guess
sorry, the problem was the clutch wasn't, uh, the choke wasn't engaging, sorry. Um, so I just had to fiddle around with that until it was working. So it should start now. There you go. So how strong tobacco plant. So yeah, that ties really deep in the ground there. That's like far down. So whew, I'm, I might have to reverse it and fill that back in. The plate just got pushed back and buried. So it's gonna be pretty hard to pull this out, but still, I'm gonna try. Okay, so I filled the hole back in. So now there's nothing there. Still got the milk bottles. They're not doing too much, but then who knows, I might have uh, pulled up if I didn't have them. I've chopped away quite a bit. So, it's um, very high li highly likely. That'll pull out now. What I want to do is I put the rope a bit higher up than before. And so, let's see if it'll pull out now. Going over to the hammer set up, to the hammer set up. But it's out now. My phone's on like 4% charge, so I can't really actually see the screen of my phone, so I don't know what you're looking at. But it's a good size. It ripped this all up because the rope went up and then it came back down when it got pulled over. And there was a bit of skidding there, so I chucked it into second. And then ripped it out and then pulled it first all the way so it wouldn't disturb the trees too much. 
but if we come back down here there is quite a bit of stuff missing so yeah that did it good and I'll see ya